Okay, it's project time. I'm so happy I got to see everybody's face in circle time. That's so fun for Miss Sarah. Okay, so today we are going to make our hand. Here's our hand. Ooh. And you're gonna trace your hand. I'm using a marker, that's why my hands are so dirty. But you guys can use whatever you want. So once you draw your hand like that, I want you to number your fingers. You can number them any way you want. So you can number it like you count, like one, two, three, four, five, right? Or you do it one, two, three, four, five. Whatever, whatever you want to do. I'm gonna do it one, two, three, four, five, and there's your hand. Okay, so that's your counting hand, cool. And then I want you also, I already kind of started this hand. So once you get this, so do another hand. Still my hand, I just traced it earlier, see guys? Okay, now you're gonna take your hand and I want you to look at your hand. Ooh, there's my hand. And I want you to like look at what, like see there's those like little wrinkles on your knuckles. So I'm gonna do some wrinkles on my knuckles, right? Ooh, is there wrinkles on your thumb? Oh, there is. So some wrinkles. And then what else do you have on your hand? You have fingernails, so I'm gonna make some fingernails. Some fingernails. And I want you guys to get as creative as you can. So look, I can see like, look at those bones in my hand. Look, if I flex them, maybe you guys can do that with your flex and relax, flex. See, so I'm gonna make mine like my hands flexed. And we can see all those little bones in your hand. That is so cool. So show me what you guys get. I, I think there's more knuckles here even. Wow. I can't wait to see your hands. Have fun. Moose is really enjoying your hand pictures, guys. He said, keep it up, guys. You're doing a good job. You're doing a real good job. All right, for me today, I forgot to do our special shape of the day. What? But... It's a really fun one today. Today is the heart, which is made out of two of the same side. So you do like up and then to a point and then up and around and to a point. And so I want you to do a couple hearts on your page. I'm gonna do four. The cool thing with heart, actually I'm gonna do six so I can show you. Sometimes you can do like a really thin heart. And sometimes you can do a really thick heart. So I want you guys to draw a bunch of emotions. How many emotions can you think of? So this big heart's gonna be so happy. And then this little heart, he's gonna be surprised. Oh, <gasps> what? He's like, what? And this one's gonna be sad. Oh, poor guy. And this heart is gonna be um, silly. He's gonna, whoa, he's so silly. Whoa. And this one's gonna be scary. <sighs> and this, oh, he doesn't even know, so that makes him even more scary. <laughs> and then this one's going to be. Oh, this one's gonna be sick. This one has like a runny nose. He's not feeling so good. He's not feeling so good. And today's book is Birthday Monsters by Sandra Boynton. Miss Sarah's been loving these Sandra Boynton books. Let's see. Birthday Monsters. Oh look, there's a baby in this book. Hi baby. <laughs> if you're not awake, it's six o'clock. If you hear a ring, you hear knock, knock. You hear the door come crashing down. 
the birthday monsters are in town. <gasps> Let's see. Five birthday monsters barge right in. And yell, it's morning. Let's begin. Oh, man. They rush you down before you're ready. <gasps> And use your breakfast as confetti. They're like, happy birthday. <laughs> oh, look, they shout, it's 6.08. Your present opening can't wait. Oh, they're so excited. They've brought the presents they like best. You get the wrap, they keep the rest. What? They brought in presents that they keep? <laughs> oh, what is this? And now they say it's hide and seek. You go and hide and we won't peek. Oh, they're closing their eyes. You find a hiding place that's great. You wait and wait and wait and wait. You realize 20 minutes later that they're raiding the refrigerator. Raiding, that means they're, they're going through. They're taking all your stuff. They're taking all the food. It's time for cake, the monsters shout. Hurry, blow the candles out. Oh my goodness. You close your eyes and make a wish and blow upon an empty dish. What? They ate all his cake while his eyes were closed. What? And now goodbye, it's been a thrill. And out they go, the house is still. They. They took your gifts, they ate your cake, they made a mess that monsters make. There's nothing more that could go wrong. And then, knock, knock, and ding dong. One last surprise is here for you. It's birthday monster cleaning crew. Aw, they're going to make it all clean for him. Look, they've got their scrub brushes and their mops and water and towels. Oh, and even a screwdriver, you see that? They broke some stuff. <laughs> they gotta fix it. Oh, they must have had a fun party. They fix, they sweep, they scrub the floor. The house is clean, they're out the door. Oh, they had to fix the lock because they let themselves in the house. <laughs> and on your kitchen shelf you find the birthday things they've left behind. Oh. They got him another cake and a birthday card and more presents. Oh, that was a great book. The end. Okay, for project time today, we are going to be, you could say kind of like bird watchers. We're nature watchers. So what I need you to do is take a piece of paper. And hold on, Maddox. I'll let you in a second. Take a piece of paper and I want you to fold it in half. Okay, wait. And then I want you to fold it in half. Okay, so first we're gonna fold it that way, yeah. and then we're gonna fold it this way. Oh yeah, mama. Oh yeah. And then we will have created like a book, okay? And if you want, you can put your name right there. At the top, you wanna write your name there, Maddox? Can you write your name, M? M A D. Show me a D. D O X Okay. That's good. That's good. Mama's gonna help you. I'm gonna write M A D D. Yeah, o mama. X. Yeah, mama. Okay, then you write it. Okay. Write your name just like Mama wrote it. A. A. One. D. D. X. That looks like an X to me. Okay, so once you guys get your book ready. I want you to get ready to go outside. We're gonna put on some sunscreen and maybe some hats. It's really hot today. And then we're gonna start exploring and I'll meet you guys outside. So we're gonna look around and see what we wanna draw for our nature book on our walk. Oh look, 
I already see some nature. Look, an ant. Oh, he's running. You want to draw a picture of an ant? You drew a picture? So some students might take a very long time to draw their pictures. Some might do a very quick picture. More ants. More ants. Are you going to draw more ants in your book? Very good. What else do we see? What other nature things do we see? Do we see beautiful flowers? Let's see. Oh, wow. Are these beautiful flowers? Do you want to draw the flowers or no? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Okay. Green flowers. Good. I like that you're looking at the colors, Maddox. Here, let's see. Can we open up our book? And you can draw more in there. No. Let's see what other things we can find. I know when we go on a walk in our neighborhood that there is, that there are ducks. So maybe we'll draw ducks as part of our nature. Let's see. So while you guys are out on your nature walk, I want you just to kind of just be talking about like the trees. And even if there aren't like a I lot of trees tree where you there. are, see you see a tree? And then there's maybe vines on a fence. So bugs, anything you kind of see that's like nature stuff. Point it out, have a good time talking about it, learning about it, discussing like the colors. Oh, look, wait, look at these, 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 look. Look, look at these flowers, but look, see the yellow stuff? Those are aphids. Those are little bugs, do you see them? It's a bunch of, can you draw those in your booklet? I think those make the booklet. Yeah, some aphids. Wow. Can you say aphid? And an ant too. Look, we've got all kinds of wildlife. What are those, Maddox? Spider webs. Whoa. Yep, draw them in there. You're going to draw those dogs? That's part of our so nature book? He just said he saw cars, and I said, mm, I don't think cars are part of nature. What are those, Maddox? Ducks. Ducks and ducklings? That's what you call baby ducks. And a mama duck. And a mama duck. Can you draw those in our nature book? lot of little duckies. Oh, and we see all these rocks have washed in, so he's gonna he's gonna draw these rocks, huh? We are balancing while we walk on our sidewalk while we're looking for our nature things. Look at that balance. Daddy Good. Not, daddy's too big for this one. So it's kind of hard for Maddox to open it and draw on it, so we folded it over so he could write on a fresh page. That might be easier for you. So they're probably going to get more and more excited as they draw things. So then let them kind of take control. Once once they're seeing things, ooh, I want to draw that. Ooh, do it. Do you it. Might even start running. Because you're so excited. Whoa. What do you see, Maddox? That's what you need to draw? All right. All right. Oh, wow. Are there bees by the flowers? Are they collecting pollen and nectar? So cool. Look what we found. Ah, a hole. <laughs> yeah, show them the hole again. Ah, we found a hole. Other things to balance on, like this big root to this big tree. Did you guys know that the roots of trees are as far out and as long as the leaves. So that means this tree goes, has roots out to here. And watch this, if we look down into the street, the street has actually cracked from the roots because nature is strong. Thought you guys might wanna see my geeseies, my geese. Two gooses, <laughs> geese, and they really like to play with the hose. They love it. They're like, give me a bath. We love it. So that one is basil breath and the one behind it is minted. 
That's their silly little goose names. So that's what you guys can hear honking when I come outside to do stuff. These silly geese. And they lay big, huge eggs. And they're so cute in their pool. They have a big pond too, but I have to fix the net on the bottom. So they're in the pool now. Hmm. <laughs>